What's up, folks? I did promise you spoilers this morning. I'm recording this at 9 a.m., 9.23 a.m. We don't have all the spoilers yet, but the film was shown in Japan. Julian from Konzenshu did see it, among others. And um, so I'm going to hit you with some partial spoilers here. And uh, this is all we know so far. I'm going to come back later today with complete spoilers. You will have those today. This is what we know so far. So if you don't want to know what happens in Dragon Ball Z, Fakatsu no F, Resurrection F, turn this off right now. And thank you, of course, support the channel. I would appreciate that. Spread the word. Um, so we're going to get into spoiler territory right now. This is what we're aware of. This is the information that has come out. Um, again, I'm still waiting for Julian to drop more information. But if this is real, this is what we have so far. And like I said, I'm coming back later today with full spoilers. So, first of all, let's get this out of the way. The blue Super Saiyan form is real. Apparently, Goku and Vegeta... From what I understand from reading this, they have tapped into some kind of power where you can master the Super Saiyan God form. So, as a result, when they do some kind of ritual where they do get the blue hair. Now, from what I understand here, from what I'm reading, all that's come out again, don't shoot the messenger. Vegeta does not kill Frieza. In fact, um, the Redditor was completely wrong as I surmised when he came back. What happens is this. Frieza fights Goku. This is the end of the movie. Frieza loses to Goku. Then Frieza transforms into Golden Frieza. But then apparently we find out that Golden Frieza has the same weakness that he had before, where he has an issue maintaining maximum power without draining his strength. Goku takes advantage of this, but he ends up losing anyways, and apparently Sorbit gets involved. He gets involved in the fight. Um, Vegeta steps in, gives Goku a Senzu, and then fights Frieza. Vegeta starts to beat Frieza, but then Frieza, in a move of desperation, blows up the earth. Kills everybody. Goku survives because he was teleported out there by Whis, while Whis and Beerus are watching the fight. And Whis is having a, uh, what was it? Let me see what I wrote down. Uh, Strawberry Sunday. So... Goku survives. Whis uses his power to go back three minutes in time. Goku finishes off Frieza with a Kamehameha. And the most interesting thing about this, the most interesting thing, is when Goku kills Frieza, Sorbit says, all according to plan. That's very interesting to me. Very, very interesting. And um, according to what Julian said on Twitter... The movie's a fun romp, feels shorter than its running time, could have been a bit longer. Um, I'm not going to give my thoughts yet until I read the entire result. Sounds like there could be another movie coming, I'm not sure. Um, some people are going to be pissed. I, there's already a lot of negativity about this, and to be honest, rightfully so, if this is the case, I kind of understand, but also I kind of see it the other way. If this is building up to a third movie... We'll see. Um, we also found out that the big red horn guy is named Shishami, which is a pun on the word sashimi. And Gohan is the guy who finishes him off. Piccolo gives him a good fight, but Gohan finishes him off. Anyways, that's all I got for you guys right now. Um, there's going to be more spoilers coming later on this afternoon. I'm running on fumes right now. I'm like on an hour of sleep. That's why I sound so deep like this. Um... Which is kind of sexy. I know some ladies out there are digging that one, but no, seriously, I got some. Um, well, when we get the full spoilers, I'm gonna come back and do a video on it and tell everybody what's going on. But check out Konzenshu, check out, um, you know, subscribe. And like I said, I'm bringing it to you today. Uh, Fakatsu no F is out. Let's see what happens. Um, and again, after one more thing, when I get done doing the the spoilers i am going to either tonight or tomorrow whenever i have time i will do a thoughts video kind of breaking down my thoughts on this i have been a dragon ball fan for goddamn almost 20 years so i have some things to say anyways catch y'all on the flip side